you know, most people knew him as Steve or Jobs, but we had a wee in-joke. I used to call him Jobby. Just not a day goes by, I don't miss that guy. So what about you? Do you know any celebrities? No. Did I tell you I taught Calvin Harris how to work the old... Sorry to interrupt, sir. Could I have a word? What about? Dating standards. I have reason to believe you've committed multiple offences. Shall we start with the basics? Profile, photo and age. Oh, that's recent-ish. And was this before you started Photoshop? Weightlifting? I see, that's, that's still my body. It's just back from when I used to bench for a living. And it says here, I share a cool apartment with a roommate. Roommate? That's a strange name for your mum, is it not? And I have to ask, just exactly how cool is her one-bedroom bungalow? Look, we just sleep head to toe. There's no spoon in. And it says here, occupation. I work in the media. You have a paper run. What's next? Oh yes, hobbies. My mates call me the Andes because they think I am hilarious. Really? I like dad jokes. And they think I should be a stand-up comedian. Actually, I've been doing a few gigs. I've been toying with the idea of going full-time. Cool. Um, what's your best joke? Really? You want to hear it? Yeah, I'd love to. Right. I'll tell you this one. You'll love it. Always kills. <laughs> okay. How many feminists does it take to change a light bulb? I don't know. Two. One to change the light bulb and the other one to suck mad. Hello, is this the dating standards? It's bad. Really bad. It says here you're an entrepreneur. You sell much Transformer fan art on Gumtree. Sorry. Looks like I'll be needing this later.